Hello and welcome to the Ravens Report. Thanks for watching. I'm Big Turkey Hunter. And I'm Big Gravy Luke. It's Friday, November 20th. So, Big Turkey Hunter, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? Well, while ham and turkey is very exquisite, I, th I gotta say that my favorite is my grandma's homemade rolls. Well, what about you? I would say mine is gravy just in general. You could put gravy on a dirty pair of socks and I'd probably enjoy it. Nice. Well, let's go to today's announcements. That's right, next week is Thanksgiving and we'll be having a much needed break for everyone all week. Which means no school until two Mondays from now, November 30th. We at Ravens Report want to encourage you all to unplug and take your mind off of school for at least a few of those days. When we get back, it will be finals week for trimester one. We've been in comprehensive distance learning for 10 weeks now, and obviously spring too. Finals week is four days long with a grading and prep day for teachers on Friday, December 4th. That's before the second trimester starts. Your book needs pictures and you could get a gift card out of it. Your book is offering gift cards to kids who submit pictures. They're specifically looking for pictures about fall, this fall break, at home schooling, pre-COVID flashbacks, new students and freshmen. But if you have any great pictures, submit them to your book. The link was sent to you all as an announcement in Canvas, but you can also contact Ms. Hogan at Amanda Hogan at redmondschools.org with any questions. And now we're going to go to a, a breaking report from our sister channel at Channel 8 News. Here's Todd Anker. Gamers rejoice and welcome. Today we're going to talk about a study from Oxford University that showed that gamers have a better happiness rating and a better well-being than non-gamers. That and more in a minute. First, this is Channel 8 News, and I'm your anchor, Papa Danger. Well, this study from Oxford tested 3,000 participants. They played the game Animal Crossing. And in this study, they had the participants play this game for various amounts of time. Those who played the game more were found to be more happy than those that played less or less time. And the least happy of the bunch were those who didn't play at all. Now here's what our local doctor and expert, Dr. Anthony Lewis, has to say about this. I'm not surprised at all by this study. In all of my research, I have found that gamers are the most superior beings on this planet. Um, they are happier, smarter, more athletic, more creative, more funny, and just overall, any positive trait that a human can possess, a gamer has, no question. Um, and with the arrival of the PS5 and the Xbox Series X, I think that happiness in the world will rise to 100% and we're going to live in a utopia very shortly. Wow, thank you, Dr. Lewis. Great stuff. We're now going to go to an actual gamer. His name is uh, Dragon Destroyer 890. Here he is. I've been playing PS5 nonstop for the last week. I feel I have ascended beyond our mortal body's capabilities. I can see the code that operates our world. I can see things before they happen. I see the strings controlling their universe. After playing Spider-Man Miles Morales, I feel I have evolved to the next step in our human evolution. Thank you, Dragon Is Royer. Very interesting. Now here's what our team has rendered to show what our world should look like in five years when everybody has access to a PS5. Wow, that's very cool. I think I gotta get myself one of those XQ thing in the bobs. Anyway, tune in tomorrow, same time and same place. We're gonna talk to an actual dentist about how we should all be brushing our teeth with shaving cream. It's so neat. Anyway, that's our show. Thanks for watching Channel 8 News with me, Todd Anchor. I'll see you next time. That's it for today. As always, check out our YouTube page at youtube.com slash Ravens. I'm Big Turkey Hunter. And I'm Big Gravy Luke. Thanks for watching. Have an epic day.
stay classy and stay I'm safe. That's weird. That's the alarm that wakes me up and that just gave me PTSD. I've been sleeping through my alarm, which is not epic. Oh, that's very unepic. Yep.